All right, let's do a little experiment about air pressure. You can do this one from the comfort of your kitchen, probably with items you have in your kitchen. However, this one will require parental supervision, okay? Four items that you need. A used soda can, gotta be empty. You'll want a large bowl. You'll also want a measuring cup, and you'll want a long pair of kitchen tongs. All right, the first thing we're gonna do with our experiment is pour a little bit of water into our aluminum can here. It doesn't have to be a lot. Now the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take our bowl and we're gonna fill it up with some ice cold water. Um, I'm gonna take some out of the tap and probably put it in the fridge. On your stove, and be careful here. What do you do? Turn on your burners, and I'm gonna place the can right on the burner, and we're gonna heat it up, or we're gonna create some water vapor in that can as we heat up the water that's in the bottom. So what we're doing now is we're heating up our can as we're creating water vapor. The water's boiling in the bottom of the can. It's creating water vapor molecules that are pushing on the walls of the can from the inside out. We're creating high pressure, in essence, inside the can. We're gonna take our tongs, we're gonna pick up the can, we're gonna flip it upside down and quickly put it in our bowl of cold water. What that's gonna do is it's gonna make the water vapor turn back into a liquid. And as that happens, basically it's gonna take up less space. So the pressure on the outside of the can is now gonna be greater than the inside of the can and the can will crush. Are you ready? Let's try it. And voila, crush can, all from simple change in air pressure. An experiment you can try at home with kids with parental supervision.